Natural capital is all around us. And these natural assets are now being used to tackle our most pressing challenges, climate change and biodiversity loss. So what are the opportunities of natural capital for landowners, developers and investors? And how can Mitchell Moores help you? Carbon credits have been traded for years and the locking up of carbon in timber and peat is one of the best known payments for environmental services. But other credit-based solutions exist. Recent legislation obliges developers to assess their biodiversity impact. They must ensure that it's not only replaced, but increased by a biodiversity net gain of 10%. Developers can do this on-site or off-site. This off-site option provides valuable opportunities for landowners to create habitats that generate biodiversity credits. Nutrient neutrality is another key nature market. It's all about making sure that the level of nitrates and phosphates in our waterways doesn't get any worse. By managing land sustainably, improving wastewater treatment infrastructure or creating wetlands, you can generate nitrate and phosphate credits. Those credits can then be sold to developers and the opportunities extend much further in the corporate ESG market. Companies can invest in nature-based solutions either on a project-by-project -project basis or through the purchase of credits. Subject to complying with the rules of additionality, landowners can blend private and public finance by stacking different environmental services on the same area of land. Our multidisciplinary team has helped deliver numerous groundbreaking natural capital schemes. We can guide you through complexity and risk ensuring that your investments are future-proofed and make a meaningful impact. The potential of natural capital is huge. Collaboration is key. Mitchell Moores, navigating change to find a positive future.